An update this afternoon from ETSU regarding its women's basketball program. This comes one week after athletic director Scott Carter's resignation and the suspension and soon to be official termination of head coach Simon Harris. Nick Dugan is live at ETSU and has the latest details. Nick, what did officials say about the program? Yeah, Kelly, as you mentioned, it's been a whirlwind of a week here at ETSU and for the women's basketball program. But today they announced Brenda Mock Brown as their new head women's basketball coach. She comes with numbers of years of coaching experience, most recently eight years as a head coach at UNC Asheville. She's been out of coaching for a couple of years now, but this was the time to come back. She said to a community and a university that loves women's basketball, that supports its women's basketball. Now, certainly there will be challenges in taking over over this program at the time that she has, but she believes that her players and herself, they'll be able to come out stronger despite those challenges. The unexpected brings a lot of uncertainty uh, and challenges, uh, but what I was telling these young ladies in the unexpected also lies the opportunity to respond. Uh, interim athletic director Dr. Richard Sanders said that uh, Coach Brown checks every single box they had. They wanted to get this done quickly as the girls will leave Thursday to go back home before returning to campus. Uh, but they will get back out on the court starting tomorrow. We'll have more coming up later on tonight on WJHL News uh, here at 6. For now we'll send things back to you on the studio.